A new immersive exhibit is opening next week on the life and art of Frida Kahlo. Kahlo is a 20th century Mexican artist known for her self portraits and pieces, all inspired by Mexico, too. So Svetlana Boreski is one of the producers here to talk about it and just want to welcome you this morning. Nice to have you. Thank you so much. Yeah, so after, yeah, after Immersive Van Gogh, what a success. There's been a line out the door over there. I've seen it. Um, Frida Kahlo is the next artist that you want to feature. Why is she so important and just so influential right now, even years, decades later? Absolutely. This is a total phenomenon. The woman, the, this fabulous Mexican woman who lived her life and only so the glimpse of fame at the end of her life now is the icon because she represents so much, so many important social um, issues that we're all talking about right now. Um, she is a phenomenal artist. She lived her life in, she suffered through a lot of pain emotionally and physically, and she painted that. But despite all, she was a very happy woman. She loved her life. She was moved by revolution. She was open-minded. She was open-hearted. And we thought, and, and our artist, Mr. Emiliano Sicardi, thought that there is, there is such an importance to portray her character and who she was as, as, as the person, as a woman, not just her art, but actually to show us, to take us through the journey of her life. Because most of the time when we're watching this exhibit, we're seeing it through Frida's life. And this is the ultimate goal to get to know Frida, to leave this exhibit and to say that it was very nice to meet you, Mrs. Frida Kahlo. And that's, that's the beautiful thing, I think. Such an influential artist, such a powerful artist as well. When you look at her work, it just strikes you. When you enter into this immersive experience, what, what do people, what should they expect when they walk through the door? Well, the best way is not to expect anything. This <laughs> is, the, this is the, the key to be inspired and moved emotionally. However, when you walk in, in Chicago, we're specifically proud of our, of our venue. Germania Place is, is a jewel. This is the um, landmark building that was our first venue in North America that we have a special uh, place in our hearts. And when you walk in, you see that from the videos that you showing right now there is a lot of uh, the architectural elements on the walls and Ms. Emiliano Sicardi actually projected wow. having that in mind so what are you going to feel and see is the journey with beautiful visuals with amazing soundtrack and you're going to see Frida's artwork you're going to see uh, the house of Frida you're going to see the images of Mexico um, the images uh, that Diego was painted uh, painting when uh, when they were together those are Frida's uh, dresses of course a very 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 famous one and uh, this work like any other Miss Emiliano works it doesn't have in any chronological order it's going back and forth uh, because again we're in Frida's mind and this is very important but it's uh it, it, it it's it's something between the film and exhibit and uh, and whatever you want to make out of it we do encourage people to stay longer than one loop the show runs in a loop because there's so many details that you just physically cannot capture everything at once so we encourage you to stay take it in, get inspired, and get to know Frida. Yes, Svetlana, it's totally an experience, not yeah. just looking at a piece of art, just the experience of it all. So thank you so much. Appreciate it. Thank you. Well, to See find out more about the Frida Kahlo exhibit, the immersive exhibit, go to abc7chicago.com. And you can see more of the exhibit once it opens. Roz Barron is going to be live next Friday morning at Lighthouse Art Space as well. And it was so great talking to Frida Kahlo's relatives. I know, just niece, last week. Because I was like, how do you feel about that when it comes to like artwork, but now it's displayed over an entire wall. And they, they're like, this is where art is going. Yeah. Like just embracing the new experience. And the interactive nature of exactly. it and just how, how vibrant it is and how alive it is. It's so cool to see. So. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.